hope you all are fine so you are staying at home and you are fighting against covid 19 you should follow a few rules you should get up early from bed in the morning you should keep yourself clean you should wash your hands very frequently you should take healthy diet you should take balanced diet you should keep yourself hydrated you should take much water so you should follow these rules i also suggest that you can plant a tree and it will give you immense pleasure when you see the plant to grow in these days you will water the plant every day okay children so now you will move to our chapter this is second chapter a snake charmer story class 5 elias you can see uh, in this story actually uh, the name of the chapter is a snake charmer story so charming Charming word you can get here. Charming means what? If you can give the people um, pleasure, you can make them happy. Okay, so these people can make the people happy, can entertain the people. A snake charmer's story. Here you can know about the story of Aryanath. Who is Aryanath? Aryanath is a boy, okay, and he lives in village and he is telling, I can do something special which you can't do. And you know what is this? Playing bean. What is bean? This is bean, okay. This one is the bean. You can see. Uh, different kinds of musical instruments in your school also. Like tabla, harmonium, guitar, sitar. Uh, so many musical instruments you can see. So bean is also a musical instrument. And which is used by the snake charmers. Now Ariana is telling we are also uh, known as Kalbelias. Huh? And his grandfather is Roshanath Ji. And he has learned a lot of tricks uh, from his grandfather. They move from village to village. They carry their snakes in the bamboo baskets. You can also, I have drawn one bamboo basket here also. This is the bamboo basket. Okay. So they carry the snakes in the bamboo basket. And what they do? They play the bean and the snake, they hypnotize, they actually hypnotize the snake. And the snake see the bean moving and it starts dancing. So this way they earn money also, they earn their livelihood also. And what else they do? They make medicines from the plants which they collect from the nearby forest and with these medicines they treat the villagers also. Suppose uh, this stomach ache in case of fever, headache, this kind of diseases they can cure the people. They also cure the people those who are bitten by snakes and they keep the snakes and they love the snakes, they take care of the snakes, they keep the snakes in the bamboo baskets. Next, Kalbelia dance. Okay, the dance, this is a special kind of dance uh, in which uh, the people use the movement of snakes in that kind of dance. That is Kalbelia dance. And uh, mm, Generally, we find this kind of dance uh, in India, in Rajasthan. Okay, in Rajasthan villages, uh, the snake charmers, they uh, 
they do the kalvilya dances now uh, there is a misconception that uh, all snakes are poisonous if any snake bite anybody he will die but it's not true few very few snakes are poisonous only okay so few are poisonous snakes and there are non poisonous snakes also so what are poisonous snakes in your book also there are names of few poisonous snakes and these are great coral snake rattle snake which is found in desert mostly afai or saw scaled viper duboya cobra cobra is found in india also ha huh? next few snakes are there which are non poisonous snakes these are hognose snake garter snake python anaconda scarlet king snake and texas red snake okay python is very common in india now why few snakes are poisonous actually the snakes which have poisonous teeth which are called fangs they are mostly poisonous and these fangs actually what happen this teeth they secrete a poisonous substance which is called venom and this venom enters into the body of a person uh, which have been bitten by these snakes okay so this is venom now snakes are also called farmers friends how because the snakes they eat the rats of the fields and rats you know they eat the crops of the farmers okay so these rats are killed by the snakes and that's why the snakes are called farmers friends in previous chapter also i told you that uh, uh, government has made few laws to protect our wild animals you know uh, some national parks have been set up sanctuary wildlife sanctuaries have been set up to protect our wild animals that is good also no now what happened these people like snake charmers then circus people then the people Uh, who are called fortune tellers you must have seen by the side of the road also they sit with the parrot uh, monkey uh, and they do some tricks to say the fortune or to say the destiny of people so they, they are called fortune tellers so now their life has become very much means uncertain no they can't earn their livelihood so we should try to help those people huh we should hmm, although they as they are struggling for their survival we should try to help those people who should uh, keep some sympathy on our mind for those people okay and nowadays for uh, tv mobile these youtube channels uh, people uh, are entertained they have various sources for entertainment no so we should think about those people also uh, who are earning their livelihood this way think about them also and love them also take care of them also thank you